Hello, my name is Pixelated Twix, and welcome to a new game. Yes, another game on the channel, guys. I know, I know, I know, but this is my one and done, and it is called Dragon Quest Builders 2. I believe I'm saying it correctly. If I'm, ha if I'm not, I wouldn't be surprised because it's me, okay? But I decided that I wanted to try this game out. I've been watching this game for a few weeks now, and of course, I was influenced by the one and only Melanin Sims 2000, of course. But you guys, this game looks so cute, so, so cute, and I, I just had to get my little grubby little hands on it. Um, so here we are. We're at the start menu. Let's get in. All right Start a new game. It's time to design your character I don't know if the music is really loud, but um, we'll definitely uh, fix that. I am a female So we're going to go with female skin color. All right, so These look a little on the red side. Let's go with something that's more my complexion. This is about right. Yes hair so from my first go around in here, you can't really change the hairstyle, but you can change the hair color. And there's a ton, a ton of colors. Look at that. Look at all these beautiful colors. I love this color. I love this color. I love all the colors. I love them all so, so much, so much. There's like not a bad color on this little palette here, but we're gonna go with this color right here. Um, and eyes, I want to go with this color because I just think it's cute. I think it's cute. All right. So my name is going to be Twix. Why not? Pixie Twix. Let's just go with Twix. Um, do we have to delete? Okay, no. All right. Okay, cool. This name is cool. I'm happy with the character. Yes. All right. Let's go. Now. Oh, okay. Are you happy? Yes. Yes. Okay. You can adjust the game settings. Once you're happy, select confirm to save your changes and start the game. You'll be able to change these settings later. Okay. Um, hmm. All right. Um, let's change the music. How do we do this? Is it E? Okay. Um, water translucency high. Medium. Uh, on. Okay, so graphic. I want to be able to change the music a little bit because it's a little loud. Okay, there we go. The music is a little bit better. Sound effects will bring them down. Um, okay, message feed. All right, message feed, message feed. All right, I'm happy with these settings. Um, I am. Yes, I am. Yes, yes, I am. I'm excited about starting this game, you guys. It is so cute. And well, it's cute. Okay. I don't know anything about it, really. I don't know like what the story is about. This is definitely a, a blind playthrough. And we're just going to get um, a, a good idea of what this game is about. Okay. Venture forth, my children, and destroy all before you. Okay. That's how I'm gonna do, do I do I have to push anything? No? Okay. Oh Thus decreed the great and glorious high press priest Hargan, and lo, his minions of mayhem did march out march out rank upon rank to ravage the land and strike fear into human hearts. Our unholy father then gave up his mortal form so that Malroth, the master of destruction, might be reborn and the world be consumed by catastrophe. Alas, mighty Malroth was defeated at the hands of the despicable spawn of er Erdrick before Hargan's glorious vision could be brought to life. Oh! No! Cute. I'm back. Had to get some water. <laughs> the moon has waxed and waned many times since that faithful day. Now, peace reigns supreme, and our order has been scattered to the four corners of the earth. Tell me, brothers and sisters, what does a monster do when backed into a corner? It bites, I say. We must do everything and anything within our power to bring this world to ruin. Huzzah! Huzzah! All hail Hargan! Praise be Melroth! I don't know why I said it like that, but they just sound like they would have little voices. 
Oh, hellish father, hear, hear our prayer. Deliver us from this world of oblivion. Ooh. Uh, lead us ever onwards as we build your dominion of darkness together. Dragon Quest Builders 2. That's the name of the game. I'm excited about playing this game. I really, really am because it's got building in it and then there's quests. You know, all the things that I like. Twix. Yes. Yes. You are the hero who will save this world. Oh, okay. Arise, my child. Your destiny awaits. Oh. Oh. How do I wake up to... Ew. Ew. Kick, 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 kick. The look on, that, on your face. I was only ribbing you, my child. Oh, he's my friend? You're no hero. I know that much. You're one of them builders, right? Oh, I guess not. Uh, no? Yes? No? Yes? Kick, 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 kick. You're telling Fibulus now. I've got... I've got it on good authority that you're a builder, so you can drop the act. Still, at least you're not a master builder. You might only be an apprentice, but that'll do. I've actually got just a job for a lass like you. Dude, you show up in the middle of my night, in the middle of the night, and you have a sword and board, and you're a skeleton. You're dressed in full armor. What am I supposed to, how am I supposed to react to this? Okay. Once you've wiped the sleep from your sockets, come and meet me up on the deck. I don't know how I feel about that. I, I, I don't know how I feel about that. I'm not sure that I, I, I'm not sure that's a good idea. It's the middle of the night. I'm on a ship. On somebody's ship. There's a skeleton on the floor. I'm in a prison. I'm in prison. Hmm. Okay, get a move on. Use WASD to move your character and the mouse to jump the con uh, to control the camera. Press space to jump. All right. So just, you know, normal, everyday. Um, can I go into third person at all? Nope, cannot. We're playing this in first person. Uh, all right. This might be better with the controller. Just saying. I don't know. What do we got over here? Oh, that's that guy. Oh, who are you guys? Can I talk to you? Well, can I talk to you? Builder, I have something to tell you. Press E when you want to examine something or strike up a conversation with someone. I suggest you remember this advice until the day you die. Oh, and one more thing. Could you ask that? Uh, I forgot. Yeah, whatever. Um, I totally just, what do, you, what do you have to say? What do you have to say? Builder, builder, I have something to tell you. Did you know that you can run by holding shift while you move around with WASD? I'm sure the extra speed will come in handy, but take care in your high ledges or you'll meet your maker sooner than ra rather than later. Okay. Um, what's in here? Anything in here? Mm. Oh, you're cute. What are you? This is where we store our cargo. Re real slamar slamariners like me call it the hold. Say, you wouldn't be that apprentice builder. I've been hearing about you. Would you? I've been hearing about... Would you? They say you can take all sorts of stuff just from a few bits and blobs. I don't know how you builders do it. As a magnificent Hargoon said, Destruction awaiteth all that is built. To think of... To think of all that hard work going to waste. Okay. Uh, what is all this? Okay, let's just head out, shall we? All right. Um, let's see if we can talk to this guy back here. Is he gonna talk to us? Ah, the builder. Tell me, girl, do the children of the Hargun frighten you? Do you wish to flee from this folding, folding coffin? These waters are cursed. Strange voices carry across the waves, and many a vessel has vanished into vapor. The crew victims to an unknown fate. Now are you scared? Not as scared as I am, I assure you. I'll be off this death trap at the first opportunity. You're scared? Dude, you're scary yourself. Up here, builder. Okay, okay. Stairs are no match for you, I see. You just can't keep a good girl down. Kick, 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 kick. Shut up. <laughs> now, as you no doubt have spotted, we're sailing to the open ocean. You've got no chance of escaping, so don't even bother. I mean, that does look like a lot of water out there, let me tell you. All right, I'm not even going to go anywhere. Okay, now that you did get very far, anyway, you're nothing but skin and bones. At least I have skin, okay? 
Here, get this down your gullet. It's fresh from the captain's table, which is where I sit, by the way. Kick, 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 kick. Yeah, okay. Twix obtains a piece of kelp. Yummy? Yummy? That, um, that sounds delicious. That's delicious. Thank you. Appreciate it. Twix can't remember when she last ate. The thought of food makes her stomach start rumbling. Well, that kale is probably supremely good, then. Believe it or not, that kelp can be eaten. Select it with... Uh, yeah, okay, and then press that button to eat it. Do so will refill your fullness gauge and replenish some health. <clears throat> Excuse me. Scoff that kelp. Scoff that kelp before you conk out. Okay. All right. Um, okay, down in one. That kelp's pretty tasty, isn't it? The pungent aroma and slimy texture make for a spine-tingling combination. I actually do like seaweed. I like seaweed snacks. They're really delicious. Mm -hmm. One of my favorites. Um, you should thank your lucky stars you've got to scoff such a scrumptious snack because it'll be the last meal you'll ever eat. Yikes. Yep, you heard me right. You'll be dead soon enough. Oh, okay. But don't worry. You won't be shuffling off this mortal coil just yet. I've got plenty of hard graft for you to be getting on with first. All right. So what am I supposed to be doing? Talk to you again? <laughs> you can wipe that lily-livered look off your face. I'm not going to send you to the cemetery anytime soon. So long as you've got some life left in you, I'll give you a chance to keep hold of it. But you'll have to follow my orders to the letter. Okay? What's that? You want to know where we are and what you're doing here? Yeah, I do. If you're that desperate to find out how far up the creek you are without a paddle, I might add, go and talk to those five monsters beneath the flag over there. Okay. Those monsters will have a tale or two to tell you. I mean, should I? Mm, I'll talk to the five monsters. All right. You're that apprentice builder that we nabbed and canceling, aren't you? I must admit, I feel a pink of sympathy for you. It's uh, not very nice to know that you're in it's nigh. <laughs> right. Talk to the five monsters. Well, well, if it isn't the little Miss Builder, you're only an apprentice, but you're prancing around like you own the place. Honestly, you can't go anywhere. To say without the bumping in an insolent little builder, how about doing all of our hard work? Okay. The world is going down the pan, that's for sure. Our only twist is to eliminate bothersome builders. Like you, one by one. Tree hee hee. <laughs> Urgh, this ship keeps swaying from side to side. I feel a bit seasick. What's that? You want to know where we're sailing to? I'm not going to be able to keep this up. I have the foggiest, the higher up would never tell stuff like that to a lowly little dracky. Okay, let's talk to this little thing. Hello, Goomans. We're the last surviving members of the children of Hargoon, the ones that didn't get squished. We're going, we're going to bring the world to its knees in all the name of the great and glorious high priest. <laughs> what's the matter with, what's with all the slurping? I'm just salivating at the prospect of squashing you humans once for all. Oh, humans. 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 Uh, I can't do it. <laughs> and this guy. Middenhall. Canuck. Moonbrook. From forth these three kingdoms had come the hated heroes. The scions of Erdrick and laid almighty Hargan low. With his dying breath, our exalted leader surrendered his mortal form so that Malroth, the Lord of Destruction, could be born. Alas, he was too, he too was vanquished. But does that mean all hope is lost? No, I say. Hargan's ambitions did not perish with him. Maybe not today, maybe not tomorrow, but one day we will reduce this world to ruin. Okay. Oops. Huh? Yeah, okay, you guys got a hole in your deck. Just let me know. All right. This hole in your back. Okay, now who do I, do I come back and talk to you? Okay. <laughs> so you talk to the rest of the crew, eh? Obedient little blighter, aren't you? So, 
Now you know, we're the last survivors of the Children of Hargan, lo loyal servants of the mighty master of destruction himself. That means you builders are our sworn enemies. We're sailing the ocean blue, rounding up pesky vermin like you, along with anyone else who gets in our way. Okay. Hey, you want to know what we're going to do with all these builders? Yeah, I'd like to know, because, you know, bad guys always tell what they're going to do. Only the higher-ups know for sure, but I'll make no bones about it. I reckon you lot are up for the chop. Still, that doesn't mean we can't make the most of what little time you got left. Just be thankful you can get some benefit of your final moment draws if we're closer. Okay. I mean, whatever. Um, talk to you again. Listen up, Builder. Unless you want to spend the rest of your life behind bars or worse, you'll do as I say. All right? So here's the deal. Last night's storm messed up to my ship good and proper. I want you to make these things ship shape around here. To start with, I want you to break up all the driftwood strewn around the deck and bring me the wood when you're done. Go on, chop, chop. Each piece of driftwood is marked with a little icon. Run up to one and press the left mouse button to punch it into something useful. All right, like this? Yeah. All right. Use. Yes. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. Huh? Yeah. yeah. She's like, huh? Yeah. I'm just gonna do it this time. I'm just, I'm just doing it by myself. Yeah. I'm just gonna take all this. I'm just gonna take all this. Is there anything up here? Let's see you guys up here. Ooh, ooh, you've got a big head, dude. Alright. Let's bring that wood back. Give it to uh, Skeletor over here. Well, though, my deck looks much better shaped now. You've picked up all that wood. No, f no flies on you, eh? Still, I suppose I've been given a chance to save your sorry skin. We'll tend to give you a kick up the coccyx? I don't know. All the bones and stuff. You want to know why I'm giving you this chance? Truth is, as sworn servant of the Master of Destruction, I'm not supposed to fraternize with your kind. But considering the state of my ship, I've got no other choice. I feel like I'm giving him a different ways every time I talk. Probably. Anyway, it's not like you're a proper builder and you're only an apprentice at the end of the day, so I'm pretty sure it's fine. He won't forsake me for a little thing like this, right? I don't know. You should know him better than I do. Anyway, I think we've chewed the fat as long, uh, long enough. If you want to cling on to your life for a little longer, I suggest you continue working like the dutiful little builder you are. Just remember, you can get all sorts of useful materials by smashing things up. Just be careful that what you bash doesn't bash you back. Okay. What am I bashing? No one more? You're talkative. You're an odd one. Since the moment I let you out of that cell, you've been scurrying about my deck and chatting with my crew without a care in the world. If anything, I'd wager you were actually enjoying this. There must be something wrong with you. I can't explain it any other way. Don't be knowing me. I mean, why else would you wear that dopey grin on your dopey mush? Faced with the same fate, most prisoners would be scared witless, but not you. You don't know me. You what? You always look like that when someone's got a job for you? Yeah, I mean, I love jobs. I love work. Hmm, it seems like you aren't scared of us at all. I'd better keep you busy or who knows what you might try and pull. Well, I mean, dude, you see all that water out there? I'm not going anywhere. I'm not going oh, anywhere. Well, luckily, there's plenty of you for you to be getting on with. For starters, some of the boys on the deck have got jobs that need doing. Report back to me when you've sorted them out. Alright. Listen to their instructions carefully. Got it. Back over here with these dudes. All right, what's up? I've been watching you, Builder. I saw you scribble around the deck, greedily pocketing all the wood you could find. The raging tempest that struck last night washed all of our navigation lights overboard. But such things can be rebuilt, can they not? To wit, I wish for you to use the wood you collected to make some new torches. Do you see the worn-out workbench over there? I do. Use it to make five torches. Here, I believe you'll need this oil to craft them. Thank you. Just obtains three splits of oil. Awesome. Once you have the torches, you must put them back in their proper positions. The five black box will be your signs. There is one by the workbench and four more around the stairs that lead below decks. Place one torch upon each block. Okay. Don't fail me, builder. Craft five torches and put them in place. Return to me when you have finished the task. All right. I can do that. He builds. 
Um, let's see. So, just like this. How do I do this? Oh. Oh, so. Make. Oh, no, 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 no. No, 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 no. I just need. Wait, what? You said five. Oh, so I. I just... okay. That's so cute. Okay, I'm done. Escape. Okay. So. So I just. Wait, there's five. So I can't. Okay. Oh, I love it. Look at that. So cute. This is so cute. If this isn't the cutest thing. If I say that one more time. <gasps> oh, how do I get it? Okay. Okay. I was about to freak out. Like, oh no, I failed. Ah, seems you have done exactly as I asked. The guiding flames burn brightly as before. For a ship such as ours, they could do but with being a touch more sinister, if I do say so myself. But I shouldn't complain. The deck is illuminated once more. I must say, your propensity to create unsettles me. Not that it matters. It will soon outlive your usefulness. But your work is not over yet. There are others abro aboard the ship who might still find some use for you. Go to them, I pray. Who else might need me? Not you again. Not you again. Three of the other monsters on board have good jobs. They need a builder know-how. Builders know-how. You can tell who they are by the markers above their heads. As soon as you finish off one task, hurry on to the next one. Got that? Report back to me when you're done with all three. Okay. Let's see. Maybe they're downstairs. Oh, no, they're over here. Okay. Let me go over here. Sure. Oh, they, this is your twin. You must be a twin. You guys look alike. Hi. Well, if it isn't the so-called builder, anyone think you've owned the place the way you're strutting around the deck? What's with the attitude? Why does he have smell? It sounds like he's been smoking for like 40 years. You've been, you're running errands for the boys and the captain's orders. You want me to give you a job to do? I do. Tell you what, you can help me relieve the boredom of being struck on this good-for-nothing ship as long as you're not afraid to put your life on the line. Truth is, I've always wondered whether builders can fight. How do you feel about going mano a mano with the monster? I'm, I, I don't feel like I... I don't feel like I want to. Oi, you! Fancy taking a swing at this kid? Try not to kill her, eh? <laughs> ah! The long head. All right, better put them dukes up. I warn you, though, that skeleton's soldier's a proper head case. He's got a big head, that's for sure. Come and find me after the fight's finished, if you can still walk. <laughs> All right. Uh, what am I supposed to do? Just punch him? Oh, my gosh. I'm just punching him. He... Dude, you've got a head on you, man. Oh. Yay. Oh, he put his head back on well, you're a better boxer than you look. I'll give you that. Still, the only thing that those pathetic punches you heard, yours hurt was my pride. Not that I should be surprised. You're pretty bony for someone who claims to be a builder. That doesn't exactly bode well for your future career, does it? Why does he sound like that? Lucky you don't have a future to speak of it. <laughs> okay. All right, be off with you and go tell the bosun what a weakling you are. You fight worse than a wet wash washcloth. I can't read. <laughs> you fight like a cow's cadaver. You builders really aren't cut out for combat after all. Hey, I did the best I could. What's that? You would have smashed him to smithereens if you had a weapon? Yeah, I would have. It's punching. <laughs> a likely story. You're gonna bash him upside the skull with one of them torches. You're such a whiz at whipping up. Don't make me. Hey. Huh? What's that book you got there? Reading. What's that? Eureka, Twix learns a new recipe. Yes, I did. She's so cute. Look at her. A broken branch whittled to work as a weapon. Attack plus eight. Sweet. I learned how to. Don't you just stand there smirking. Tell me what's so funny. Oh, he was supposed to sell like this, wasn't he? 
No, that was old dude. Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> I forget the rules. <laughs> you know what? You just work out how to make a cypress stick. Well, I never. Are you telling me that builders can invent things as well as make them? Well, don't just stand around looking gormless. Put your money where your mouth is and make the cypress stick then. You know where the worst kitchen is, right? I do. And one more thing. Once you've made it, don't forget to equip it. A weapon's no use otherwise. Okay? Wait a minute. Show me the stick then. I didn't make it yet. I'm gonna go make it. Do I have enough to make it? Mouth is dry. <laughs> All right, I can make one of these. Sweet. This is so cute. This is adorable. Okay, this is this is so adorable. Okay, let's see. All right. And acquire a new weapon. Select it with scroll button and press the right button to wield it. Try to equip the cypress stick to deal some extra damage. Okay. All right, we've got it. It's a babet. A babet. Show me the cypress stick. Cypress stick then. The girl genius returns. Cypher stick in hand. Oh, you really look the part. What do you say, fancy? Another crack at that old bag of bones. Now you've got a weapon. I forgot what that guy's voice sounded like. Over there. Sure. Sure, why not? I'll take it. <laughs> That's the spirit. I want to watch that rotter try and put himself back together once you're through with him. I mean, all right, let's go. All right. Oop. <laughs> Ah, compound fracture! <laughs> he doesn't sound like that. Ah, uh, a bone crushing the food. I don't know if I can pick myself up after this one. Go on and last. Go and brag about beating me to the balsam. Not sure if he sounded like that either. See, I told you I can't keep up with us. Okay, I'm done. I'm done. No more voices. Well, you certainly gave that bag of bones a good hiding. Okay, just one more. Just look at the state of him. The only thing he's good for now is feeding a dog. Yeah, he's about right. Yeah. Yeah. You what? You feel a bit sorry for him? Yeah, I do. <laughs> That's a new one. I wager you no know, human ever shed a tear for a monster before. Just don't think you can butter me up by tickling my funny bone. Oh, the puns. Anyway, thanks for that builder. It certainly helped pass the time, if nothing else. I mean, you guys have got to be bored out here. There's nothing to see. I think I've learned enough. I learned something today. You builders are useless in a fist fight, but with that weapon in hand. You're not to be sneezed at. But you're not done for the day, just not yet. Not by a long shot. I've got a feeling in my bones there's someone else on board who needs help in hand. What? No pun? No hand pun? Alright, let's see how else needs a helping hand. Oh, this dude. I met you downstairs. I don't know what he wants. So what the clothes? My, my, you've been a busy little lady, haven't you? First you made those torches, and now a cypress stick. But one can hardly call oneself a builder without one's tools of the trade. Where are your build- where are yours, builder? Do you even have any? Uh, tools of the trade? No? Unless not. Other than that simple cypress stick, you haven't a single tool upon your person. Such a shame. Well, then I think we ought to do something about that, hadn't we? I confiscated this pair of gloves from the builder in the brig, de brig decks. Brig below the decks? Wow. They are yours. With these equipped, you will be capable of placing up a whole host of objects without the need to smash them first. Ideal for organizing your articles in an orderly fashion. Well, I do like good organization. So without further ado, take your newfound gloves. Gather up all the barrels strewn higgly piggly about the deck and place them on the map beside me. All of them? I feel like I'm doing chores. Like, you guys are just using this to get me to clean up your spot. I feel like that. And one more thing. Should you be using a mouse, you may press the scroll button to switch effortlessly between your gloves and cypress stick. No, go. Okay, I'm going. I'm going. I got my gloves. Nee, 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 nee. Sorry, it's Zelda. Okay. New tool acquired. Pick up stuff and plunk it down. All right. Use the gloves to move objects from one place to another. Press F to pick something up or put it down. And press C while holding something to rotate it. Okay. <clears throat> okay. Alright. 
So we just set it down here. Okay, tidy up the barrels. Right. See, he rotates it. Okay. Very cool. I'm so okay. Oh, I'm in third person. Oh, sweet. Okay, I, but I now I now that I'm in it, I don't like it. I don't like it. Okay. 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 okay I'm doing it. Okay. 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 All right. I'm bright. How do I get out of third person? How do I, how do I, I don't even know. Was it? How do I? How do I, how do I get? Oh, there we go. Oh. There we go. That's what I did. V. V gets me out of third person. Okay, so I'm making this down. Yes! Unamas. Okay. There we go. Can we talk to you? I want you to use the gloves I gave you to pick up the six barrels that are straw. I did! I did! I used my gloves. Okay. They're there. I did it. Did I not? Oh, there's. I can't count. I can't count. Let's pick it up. Pick it up. Can you pick it up? Can you not pick it up? Okay, 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 okay. okay. One more barrel. One more. All right. Now we're done. Now we're done. There we go. We can talk to dude. Wonderful work. Six perfectly positioned barrels. I'm sure you agree that a pair of gloves is an indispensable tool for any budding builder. Of course. I was under the impression that the youth of today were nothing but a swarm of work shy wastrels. But based on your showing just now, I may have to reassess my stance. Well, I think you guys are. I'm the one doing all the work here. Alas, no matter the blood, sweat, and tears you shed in servitude, you'll always be a builder, the eternal enemy of our exalted order. I fear your time among us will be short. Uh, will be but short, but your fate is not for me to decide. That is the captain's responsibility. Right. Uh, I think we're done here. Thank you, sir. Uh, it would appear that you've attended to everyone's errands for now. Hurry along and inform the good captain that you require some more back-breaking chores. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go back here. What do you want? Not bad, not bad. Looks like you've done everything the lad has asked of you. Nice to see a human working her fingers to the bone for us monsters, and without a word of complaint either. If I doubted it before, I'm certain now you actually like this sort of thing. You're a proper weirdo, you know that? Still, I won't be satisfied until I hear it from the horse's mouth, so to speak. Do you enjoy building things? I do. I do. <laughs> of course you do. It's what gets you out of bed in the mornings. I can tell from the look on your fleshy face. You've got all the makings of a master crafter. And that's why we can't let you live. Great. I should have told him I didn't like it. Okay. Well, what with you builders being our mortal enemies and everything, I can't exactly have you running bow to stern, building like Billy O. Now can I? What the heck is Billy O? I'm sure sorry to say, kid, but I'm going to have to sever that smiling skull from your shoulders right now. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Just tickling your lips. Don't look so scared. I'm not really going to lop your noggin off. Well, as long as you stay on my good side, that is. After all, I wouldn't want to lose a willing worker like you. I reckon you've got what it takes to be a crackling little cabin girl. And what more? I like the cut of your jib. What do you say, Lassie? Will you join my skeleton crew? Uh, you don't have to say anything. I can tell you're too overcome with joy to thank me now. Actually, there's something else I've been meaning to ask you. What's that big book you're looking around? I've never seen anything like it before. Uh, oh, it's raining. Huh? Where did the rain come from? What? You have to tell me later. Lassie, looks like there's no storm rolling in. Yay, you guys just gonna leave me up here? Ooh. Okay. And a pr mm, ah, an apprentice builder. You will do nicely. What? Who's talking? Are you talking to me? Are you talking to me? Who's talking to me? Who's talking? This is your world to create and yours to destroy. Who is talking to me? 
Are you talking to me? Um, now come to me, my child. Okay, they're obviously not talking to me. Who am I talking to? Who's talking? Oh, wait, cloth ears. What are you gawking at? Didn't you hear me? Yeah, I, I told you to get your fleshy rump below decks and into the hold. It's far too dangerous up here for a land leper like you. Okay, okay, okay. What's this going to be? Oh. oh! Wow! What the heck's going on? Whoa! Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh. C Captain! Get into the hold quickly! We're, we're in deep woo woo down here! Blimey, I don't like the sound of this. Hold on tight, I'm on my way! Oh my gosh. You're alright there, Builder? Ah, but I can't be stopping and help some human. I've got to get to the hold. Hargon, preserve us. This is bad. This is really bad. Hey, Builder, get your bony backside in here. Pronto, I need your help. I mean, you just you let her lay there on the floor and you want her help. Well, it's water. Over here, Builder. Okay. You got water in here. Ugh, this looks familiar. I've done this before. You ever played Minecraft? I've done this. Okay, let me just... Can I pick this up? Can I pick this up? This is up. This is picking it up. Nope. Can't do this. How do we... What, 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 what? Six? Do, do I just... How do I... What do I do? What do I do? Do I... Nope. What do I do? Do I... What do I do? I don't know what to do. What do you know? Oh. Sweet. There we go. I saved you. I was close shave than I'd rather have liked, but you did it. You saved my... Oh, throw me a bone. No more holes. There are holes everywhere? Let me guess. Oh, wow. We're taking more water. You've got to do something. Use some more crates. Plug up all these holes. Fine. Okay. I'm telling you. I feel like I... Listen. Okay, there we go. I'm like, I can't do it. I can't do it, Captain. I do have the power. Um, how many, how many holes do we have? This is the two. This is too cute. I said this before. I'll say it again. Too cute. Oh my gosh. You're a lifesaver builder. Oh no, I owe you one. But our run in with that rock has made mince meat of my hull. The next wave that hits us could. What? Oh, well, all right. Wah! I knew it. You guys suck. It's a race against time builder. Cram some more crates in those holes and hurry. Mm -hmm. <sighs> He's only one. You know that, right? Oops. This is actually really fun. Building with purpose. Happy little boxes. All right, I did it. I did it. I did it. Did it? Did it? I'm so cute. All right, we done? Did we good? Did I get everything? You shored up my ship, good and proper, builder. I don't know where we'd be without you. Why do I sound? I swear, he's got his own voice. He's got like five different voices. This guy. She'll hold for now, but who knows how much. Very much like, oh, throw me a bone, we're done for. Oh, well, then. holy moly, look at that one. We don't have any crates big enough to plug up that hole of the hole of that size. Nope. This isn't it. This is it, Builder. It was nice knowing you, but don't forget me, Builder. Ah, don't forget you. I won't. Oh, Square Enix. That was fun. General Director Yuji Hori. Yep, saying that wrong? No, it. Oh! Oh! Oh my 
goodness, that was, wow. All right. What a great prologue. I like it. I like it. I really do. Very cute. Achievement unlocked. Shipwreck survivor. Awesome. Well, you guys, I think that is all for today. <laughs> We've been recording this for over 40 minutes and I just don't want to, you know, keep it going any longer than this but if you liked my first video in dragon uh, quest builders give me a thumbs up please that helps the channel so much also if you're not a subscriber i hope you decide to stick around for a little while by hitting that subscribe button and the notification bell all right guys until next time i have been pixelated twix she is little twix ciao